so really quickly I just want to show you guys a labor of love um, this baby's nursery has for the most part been a huge DIY so um, yeah uh, the dresser that I originally wanted was around $300 and while I could have afforded to pay that I didn't want to because most of the stuff that I see that I like I can make myself or I figured that I can make it myself and you can too so um, here's a dresser that I bought at a used furniture store the man wanted seventy dollars for it because it is like solid wood um but i haggled him down to 50. so i paid 50 dollars for the dresser and i paid the paint that we use um is by valspar and i paid like 324 per jar and i bought two jars it's in um the color cream delight and yeah so i'll show you and it, it matches the baby's crib like perfectly so um, it's outside drying right now. We just put the clear coat on it. And now I'll stop babbling and show it to y'all. I'll show you guys the knobs. Um, Emery has the clear coat there. She's gonna do the knobs. And I painted the knobs. I actually mixed that paint color from the leftover um, cream color, white cream, I mean, whatever I said, the color of <laughs> cream delight by Valspar. And then I mixed it with some gray paint, uh, craft paint that I had left. So that's where, um, I got that from and here are the drawers for the dresser the dresser is not that big it looks big but it's really not um there's eight drawers to the dresser and here is the dresser i'll get at a better angle i have to step in my flower bed but um yeah there you can see the dresser i think i did a pretty good job painting it i did it all myself and yeah and I'll make sure to include a before picture so you guys can see it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, yeah, so you guys can see it a little bit better. But yeah, as you can see, like the inside there is solid wood. Like the dresser is legit. And there are the drawers again. Eight drawers. 16 knobs. There's two pulls per drawer. So um, these should be about dry now. So I'm going to bring them back inside and put the knobs on it. Then I'll show you guys the finished product baby y'all she is struggling with trying to spray these knobs come on baby you got it okay let mommy do it because it's getting a little dangerous because you you just putting pressure on it but it's okay you can help me push them in okay is that good show them show them the, um the bottle show them the the can so we can show them what, what we use turn it around so they can see the front move your hand off of it there it is clear glaze triple thick crystal all right. And now, seven to go. One, two. Oh, hi, guys. <laughs> okay, so now um, I'm just going to show you quickly how I do it. I'm just going to stick the screw in there. Oh, oh you can't see in that angle. <laughs> Let me see. Maybe if I turn the drill upside down. But how do you uh, like know how to do it? It will be silly. Yeah. Be careful. Oh, that's really right. Meanwhile. <laughs> and here is the finished product. Um, I did scuff it just a couple of times, but it's okay. And it had that little... When I bought it, the little scuff there, but the overall still looks good. I'm not very good at this game. I'm not very good at this. I think all right because my my daughter talks so much, y'all. Like, but here is the um finished product with the dresser. Some target stuff over there. I gotta take care of. But yeah, so I'll send you. Uh, I'll send you. I'll take another little um video of when we get it all set up and stuff too. So hit the like button if you like um, this DIY dresser. Like I said, we do the knobs and repaint everything. So hope you guys like it. Really, really, really had a good time making it. And I got this thing under here so it'll slide on my floors without scratching them. So yeah, I guess I'll go take this in the baby's room now.